only 81 degrees after a morning start of 77. So yes, a four degree difference from the morning start to what we did for our daytime high. And again, another below average day here across South Florida. So it's in place. This is what we need is the orange and the bronze colors. The dry air is in place here across South Florida. But what's been winning out is this area of low pressure, kind of the tropical moisture left over from what was TD9. It's sitting way down towards our south and still throwing it our way. But you could see the last couple of trends and the last couple of loops showing that it is moving out of the picture. And that means that the sunshine will be back as we go through Saturday. Right now, live first alert Doppler radar. Yes, we're dry, so no need for the umbrella for your Friday evening plans. In fact, it's kind of a tale of two South Floridas yet again for today. We go out towards Okeechobee and Belle Glade. Clear, much more sunshine out towards there, right along the coastal sections. Still kind of gray with mostly cloudy skies. Temperatures are nice on the comfortable side. That breeze just adds a little touch of fall in the mix. 78 currently for our friends in Jupiter, 80 down in Boca, and 77 in Vero Beach. So here's the future track showing you again that we're not going to be dealing with any kind of rain shower activity. What it do want, what it does want to hint at, as we go through early Saturday morning with this northeasterly and onshore flow, one or two isolated flyby showers. Those quick movers could move across the Treasure Coast, but again, most of us will be dry as we go through your Saturday as high pressure sneaks on in and just reinforces the dry stuff that we've been seeing here across the area. So for tonight, some clearing, breezy out there, northerly wind at 15 to 20 miles per hour, not low, about 74. Tomorrow, beautiful day. The sunshine is back. High pressure settles shop. Right on top of us, the northerly wind still on the breezy side, 10 to 15. Your high temperature, comfortable, 81 degrees. What is not looking so good is going to be boating for your Saturday into Sunday as our winds, still strong out there, are going to kick up those seas anywhere between 6 to 8 feet. Choppy conditions on the inland waterways, but nice on the beaches. Lots of sunshine, a mix of sun and clouds, and temperatures still comfortable in the low 80s. And as we take a look at South Florida's most accurate forecast again, the dry weather continues all the way through Thursday. Then the wind flow back out of the south and southeast pumps in a little more moisture, so we add the rain chance back in as early as Wednesday.